this is the pancreas this is the pseudocyst here is the pseudocyst after how many days after how many days four to six weeks four to six weeks okay so now what are you going to do with this there is a pseudocyst the patient is complaining of pain and in the pseudocyst if you leave it like that it may obstruct the duodenum also so what you will do drain it yeah we have to to a cyst or jejunostomy yeah yeah so you have to drain it yes good so where you will drain you will drain outside or drain inside inside why inside because it's uh, not infected not infected it is not infected one good and second reason is these are all enzymes only the collection of enzymes only and if there is a constant connection between the pancreas and the cyst so if you connect it to the normal bowel so these enzymes and all will be come into the normal bowel only okay so we have to do a histo enterostomy we call it as histo enterostomy if it is located here in this see there be, be, it can located anywhere in the uh, tail it can located it can be located in the here okay depending upon the anatomical location if it is located here we will do a histo the stomach is near so what we will do we will drain it inside the stomach inside the stomach that is known as histo gastrostomy that is known as histo gastrostomy okay so if it is near the duodenum we will drain into the histo duodenostomy If it is near the jejunum, we'll drain into the jejunum. This is the jejunostomy. Okay, is it clear? Okay. So the most common site is the lesser sac of the stomach. Most common site is the lesser Sir, sac of the stomach. Can you please repeat the previous slide? This one. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'll repeat it. See, we are talking about pseudo cyst of pancreas. Pseudo cyst of pancreas is nothing but it is just a walled off collection, which is not infected. Okay, the pseudo cyst can lie anywhere. It can lie in the head. It can lie in the body. It can lie in the tail. Anywhere. So this pseudo cyst is nothing but it is a. It is having a direct connection from the pancreas, which is containing all the important enzymes. so we will if it is useless to drain it outside it is an app it is a cyst only you can drain it outside but, but it is it is always worthy to drain it into the abdomen so that it will be helpful in the digestion isn't it yes no yes yeah, sir but it is it a temporary drainage or uh, it will be permanent it will be permanent drainage once after some time it will heal on itself the pseudo cyst heals and again it will become normal if you do a enterostomy because of the pressure variations it will heal on itself Okay, sir. Okay, so, so if it is enterostomy, the it drains into. No, enterostomy meaning it drains cysto enterostomy. Yeah, cyst is draining into which uh, part, sir? I'll tell. Cysto enterostomy. I mean that enterostomy means any part of the bowel. Okay. Either the stomach, either the duodenum, either the jejunum. If it is located near the stomach, it is cysto gastrostomy. If it is duodenum, cysto duodenostomy. If it is jejunum, cysto jejunostomy. Okay, but we don't know it, right? So we will just call it as cysto enterostomy. Okay. This should be drained into the bowel. That's all. Okay. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So the most common site is the lesser sac, and investigation of choice is CECT again. Here also it is CECT. So in GI, what we are seeing is most of the times it is CECT only. The investigation of choice is CECT, isn't it? so yes, there is sir. a classification for this it is bzdo classification no need to go into the details but for just completion sake this there are three types type 1 type 2 type 3 okay just remember this this is not asked in our exam so treatment conservative and intervention only after 6 weeks okay it should be after 6 weeks then only why after 6 weeks to find out there is pseudocyst um, sorry because they may resolve spontaneously that's why one yes very good so we have to wait for at least 6 weeks because 
they may go into spontaneous what i told after 6 weeks they were good spontaneous result there is no need to do okay if it is persisting after 6 weeks only we need to do one point and second point before 6 weeks if you enter you will not find any wall only there will be just be collection okay after 6 weeks they will just develop a wall around it so that is one and the at least it should be 6 cm okay the mm-hmm. thickness of the length of this is should be 6 cm it should be a big cyst no no point in doing what small cyst and the thick wall should be there 6 cm 6 mm thick wall this we will get to know as ect if there is thick wall only we can anastomose if it is a small papery thin wall we cannot do anastomosis okay so remember this 36 6, 6 weeks 6 cm and 6 mm okay yes okay. no yeah 6 mm is the wall and 6 cm is the 6 cm is the size size of this is 